Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use custom themes for the Iced GUI library, which is a GUI library for the Rust programming language. Uh, I'm going to use custom themes or show you how to use custom themes on this application that I have. So this is a simple calculator application and I'm going to apply a custom theme to this application. So what I mean by that is I'm going to override the default themes for the container widget and the button widget. So um, let me navigate to the code where this is happening. So in this display text uh, uh, widget, which is this display area you see here, uh, I'm going to change this to primary and going down to the entire uh, container level so the container will be this entire application I'm going to add a style uh, called theme container bordered so I'm going to give it a border and this button will have a primary style and if we go towards it in the primary we can see that the uh, primary style entails having a border and uh, the color is going to be this specified color which is a bluish type of color so if we close this application now save our changes and then run our application again we can see that our application has a blue border around the edges so this is because of the custom theme that we have defined for container. So container style sheet for theme. Uh, we are overriding the default theme and we're using the appearance method to give this bordered appearance. So this border appears uh, because we've explicitly overridden the de default values uh, for border with radius and color. Similarly, in a button, <clears throat> we can see that there's a border around here, and that's because we have over overridden the default values for a button as well. So that's the basis of how uh, custom themes are used. Uh, so what I'll do now is show you the code behind this custom theme. Um, so what we have to do is we have to declare a module called theme and then inside theme we can add the code required for any widget that you need a custom theme for so in my example I'm using a custom theme for container widget and for the button widget so that's why I declared uh, enum container and these are the two types of uh, themes that can uh, go into styling the container. So there's the default, which is the default container that is no different from uh, the container styling that Iced provides. And then there's the bordered. And the bordered is where I added my custom uh, styles. So here you can see the border style coming in. So next we have button. So here we have primary and secondary. So primary adds the uh, border styles by using radius, width, and color and also giving it a different background. And then secondary changes the background to a grayish type of background. And uh, this is the style for the rest of the buttons that you see here. So these buttons are using secondary and this display text which is also a button is using primary uh, custom theme so that's how you do it a um, few things to keep in mind are the imports so there's another uh, import called theme that you might have imported into your application um, I think it's in if you do use iced theme and you can see this theme right here so if you have this imported using this module theme is going to conflict with this import so I recommend that you remove it so once you remove that add these two 
uh, imports. So we're going to use self theme theme. Instead of iced theme, we're going to use self theme. So self theme is basically referring to this module right here, and theme within it is the struct right here. So uh, this import is very uh, crucial because otherwise you'll run into errors. And if you have widgets that import theme or something like that, you might have to remove them. Also make sure to import a widget, uh, which is a custom widget instead of the iced widget element. We are using uh, the self widget, which is a module that we've defined that uh, overrides the default widget that you can import from uh, iced. So this is the code you, that you need here. And uh, so that's how you do a custom theme. I'll add a bit uh, more helpful GitHub examples of using custom themes to the video description. And uh, before we go, I'd like to show uh, the iced uh, page. So this is the uh, GUI uh, library for Rust uh, called iced that we can use to make uh, these graphical user interfaces. Uh, let me see if I have uh, those snippets. Yeah, so this is the snippet I was talking about. Uh, in the custom theme uh, location, you can see an example of using custom themes. And this example that I'm using is uh, taken from this GitHub uh, repo. So I'll include the link to this description so that you can have uh, a better idea of how to use these custom themes in order to better style your applications uh, what, uh, when you're building with iced, uh, the GUI library. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned something. Uh, if you found it helpful, uh, consider liking the video or subscribing to the channel. And thanks again, and I'll see you in the next video.